Okay, but then you can just remove one of the talismans. So it goes as follows. And stand here with a right foot next to this brick and left foot next to the skeleton. Then aim with your head approximately at the eye of this dragon. Then uh, inch forward until your right foot stands on top of that brick. Like this. Now throw a pot, then do an attack with your dagger and then throw another pot. Like sometimes this guy aggroes, but it's very rare, and I do have no idea why this happens. But it, it shouldn't be a problem. You can, you have all the time in the world to uh, kill him in this. Then hold the ball. This guy, as usual. Then go a bit forward to bait him for attacking you. Then run away all the way behind here, behind this pillar. Wait un until he goes a bit closer, buff up. Kill him and spam two more times, so it hits his hitbox for extra damage. Then go to this guy. <laughs> go like this behind him, right into his ass. Buff up, use the ADLS. It will almost one-shot him, then through, throw uh, two pots. Restore mana. Oh wait, what? Okay. Like, usually he doesn't... He doesn't start rolling, but that's okay, actually. He, he will uh, go asleep during the roll, so you can just strafe to the side and he will miss you. That's completely... Uh, Avoidable. I just didn't know that he can even do that in the first place. Okay, so now stand behind him again. Use the DLS again. And now you have to you just have to finish the last guy. It shouldn't be a problem. You can lure him like here. Oh, nice recovery. <laughs> Yeah, so you can just finish him as you go. Doesn't really matter. Probably better to finish him off with lightning spear. Kakashichny setup, da da da. On Sami. Yeah, so I actually thought that uh, that fat guy cannot start rolling. Maybe I was a bit late on throwing the pots, actually. Maybe. That, that was probably why he started rolling. So, let's repeat this. Aim at the eye. Like this first part where you throw two pots at this guy and then get advantage of striking that guy first. While he's AFK, I think that would be useful in a lot of rounds. So, so at the end... Uh, yeah, I would. I forgot to fix my HP in the cheat engine. <laughs> but I shouldn't get hit in the first place, so <laughs> let's just... Let's just do it clean this time. Yeah, so this is like 100% reliable in terms of the left guy going to sleep. But sometimes the other guy aggroes. Like, it's very rare, but it happens. Like, it's better to lure him to this side so he then he cannot strafe to the right and get a better angle of us. Yeah, so he will always hit the wall and will not break far enough to get appropriate angle to hit with the light, with, with the black orb he cast. Black fireball. <laughs> you can also shoot lightning spear twice at him and you will also get extra damage. 
but not three times. Third will missed already. This guy also receives different damage from time to time, but it doesn't really matter. Only thing that matters is to for two ADLSs to have total like total amount of damage enough to to finish them off. And it's way less ra random than with one ADLS. It kind of averages out. So you basically, during the whole fight, you only have to deal with this guy, that's it. Like, you don't have to deal with fat guy, because he's always asleep. At least uh, until you are doing everything pretty fast. If you start, like, stalling and running around, then he'll probably awake. Because the sleep is not very long, actually. Yeah, and sometimes you can just finish him off like this. If you're lucky enough with the DLS, uh, DLS hits. So yeah. And that is how it goes.